Today, we have an exciting topic for all the Belgian Malinois owners and enthusiasts out there. We'll be discussing the seven most effective tactics for training your Belgian Malinois. These dogs are known for their intelligence, energy, and versatility, but they also require proper training to ensure they become well-behaved and happy companions. Number 7. Start Young Starting socialization early with your Malinois puppy can help them develop into a well-adjusted and friendly adult dog that loves meeting new people and animals. Puppy play dates, introducing new environments, and socializing with other animals are all important components of socialization. When introducing your puppy to new people, it's important to do so in a positive and controlled environment. This will help your puppy associate meeting new people with positive experiences. Introducing your puppy to new environments is also important for socialization. Take your puppy to different places such as the park, beach, or city streets. This will help them become comfortable in new surroundings and develop confidence. Socializing with other animals is important for your Malinois to understand how to interact with other dogs and animals. Make sure to introduce your puppy to different types of animals, not just dogs. This will help them become more well-rounded and adaptable. Spending quality time with your dog is the next step to ensuring a happy and healthy relationship. Number 6. Quality time is important. Make sure you're spending quality time with your furry friend every day, as this will help strengthen the bond between you and keep your dog happy and healthy. Belgian Malinois are active and intelligent dogs that require mental and physical stimulation. Playing fetch, going for walks, and using interactive toys are all great ways to spend quality time with your Belgian Malinois. These activities will not only help your dog stay physically fit, but also mentally stimulated and engaged. By spending quality time with your Belgian Malinois, you'll be able to better understand their needs and temperament. You'll also be able to detect any changes in their behavior, such as aggression or anxiety. Moreover, spending time with your dog is beneficial for your own well-being, as it can reduce stress and increase feelings of happiness and belonging. So, make sure to prioritize spending quality time with your furry friend every day. And remember, being gentle with your dog is crucial for a happy and healthy relationship. Number 5. Be gentle. When interacting with your furry companion, it's important to be gentle and patient to foster a loving and trusting relationship. Using positive reinforcement, gentle handling techniques, and introducing toys during training can help build this relationship. Here are three ways to be gentle with your Malinois. Use a soft voice and avoid yelling or physical punishment. This will help your dog feel safe and secure around you. Handle your dog gently, especially during training. Avoid yanking on the leash or using a choke collar. Incorporate toys into training sessions to make them more enjoyable for your dog. This will help your dog associate training with positive experiences. If you're being gentle with your Malinois, you can build a strong bond and create a positive training experience. When teaching your Belgian Malinois commands, start at eight weeks old with reward-based training techniques. Consider using clicker training, which eliminates confusion and helps reinforce positive behavior. As your dog ages, adjust the length of training sessions accordingly. Begin with simple commands like sit and build from there. Number 4. Start training at 8 weeks old. Puppy training promptly at 8 weeks prevents problematic behavior in Belgian Malinois. It's crucial to start training your Malinois puppy as soon as possible to establish good habits and prevent unwanted behaviors. The first step in training your puppy is create training. Create training benefits your puppy by providing a safe and comfortable space for them to rest and sleep, while also preventing them from engaging in destructive behaviors when unsupervised. Consistency is key when it comes to training your Belgian Malinois puppy. You should establish a routine and stick to it using positive reinforcement to reward good behavior. Potty training is also an essential aspect of training your puppy. Set a schedule for taking your puppy outside to go potty and praise them when they do so outside. 
When starting your Malinois puppies training at eight weeks old and being consistent in your efforts, you'll set the foundation for a well-behaved and obedient dog. With any breed, it's best to start training as soon as you get them. Even if they're too young to understand tricks or commands, a Malinois can begin learning associations behind its behavior. Whether your dog is eight weeks or eight years old, setting rules and expectations when they enter your home will make training easier now and later. Number three, use reward-based training techniques. By using positive reinforcement and rewarding good behavior, you can create a strong bond with your furry companion and foster a happy and obedient relationship. Here are some benefits of reward-based training and common mistakes to avoid. Benefits of reward-based training Builds trust and respect between you and your dog. Encourages good behavior through positive reinforcement. Strengthens the bond between you and your dog. Common mistakes to avoid in reward-based training. Giving rewards too often or inconsistently. Failing to recognize and reward good behavior promptly. Over-relying on treats and not using other forms of praise. If you've been using punishment-based training methods, it may take some time for your dog to adjust to reward-based training. Start by gradually reducing the use of punishment and increasing the use of rewards. Remember to always praise and reward good behavior and avoid punishing bad behavior. By doing so, you can create a happy and obedient relationship with your furry companion. Dogs can have several unique motivators. One of the best is their favorite food. A tasty treat will keep your Belgian Malinois puppy focused on you. The Malinois' energy and distractibility create an uphill battle as they do with many puppies and you'll need help being more interesting than anything else in their environment. Once they know you have what they want, your Malinois will be more attentive and willing to listen. Using food will then help you teach the basic commands like heal, sit, down, leave it, and stay. Don't rely on treats, but on your dog's preferred high quality kibble. You'll go through several treats during a short training session and you should factor them into your dog's daily diet considerations. Number two, consider clicker training. Consider incorporating clicker training into your furry companion's obedience routine. It's like adding a melody to a song to enhance their learning experience and strengthen your relationship. Using clicker training is a form of positive reinforcement that rewards your dog for performing the desired behavior. By clicking the device at the exact moment your dog does something right and then immediately giving them a treat. Your dog will associate the sound of the click with the reward and will be more likely to repeat the behavior in the future. One of the benefits of positive reinforcement is that it creates a positive and fun learning environment for your dog. Incorporating play into training, such as using a clicker, will not only make it enjoyable for your dog, but also for you. Clicker training eliminates any confusion and allows you to communicate with your dog more effectively. Remember, training should be a fun and engaging experience for both you and your dog. Number one, increase training times as the dog ages. If you want your Belgian Malinois to stay engaged and motivated during training, it's important to adjust the length of your training sessions based on their age and energy level. Puppies and young dogs have shorter attention spans and can become easily fatigued. So it's best to keep training sessions brief and frequent throughout the day. As your dog grows older and more experienced, you can gradually increase the length of each session while still paying attention to signs of burnout or exhaustion. To prevent burnout and keep your dog's training sessions enjoyable, here are three tips to keep in mind. Vary the activities. Mix up the types of training exercises you do with your dog, such as obedience, agility, and scent work. Take breaks. Give your dog frequent breaks during training sessions and make sure they have access to fresh water and a comfortable resting place. Adapt to senior dogs. As your dog enters their senior years, they may not have the same energy levels as before. Adjust training sessions accordingly, focusing on mental stimulation and low impact exercises. By adapting your training sessions to your dog's age and energy level, you can keep them engaged and motivated while also preventing burnout and exhaustion. Thanks for joining us today. 
Until next time, keep training and keep bonding with your amazing Belgian Malinois. Please subscribe to The Amazing Dogs. Take care.